Twisted aliens and demented cultists battle across the devastating science fiction world of Dark Age. Muster your forces and learn to survive at beastsofwar.com. Greek mythology rages to life in mythic battles pantheon. Become a god and command heroes and monsters in a battle for Olympus at beastsofwar.com. Hi everybody, welcome to another Let's Play here on Beast of War. I am joined by John and Az. And Az, you are essentially becoming our board game guru. Yeah. So in the future, this, this is going to be our guy. This is the <laughs> guy for board games on this site. So you've brought a game in for us. What have you got for us today? Yeah, I thought I would start off with a bit of Wild West action. This is Colt Express. We're going to be fighting over a 3D train, trying to see who can get the most loot, punching, shooting, dodging the marshal, and see mm -hmm. who's going to be the best bandit in the West, essentially. Okay, I'll, I'm, I'm up for this challenge. Can I be cliche and say, I'm gunning for you? Oh. <laughs> I'm really sorry. Oh. Straight to the, the inner child. Oh. Oh. Right in the field, right there, man. <laughs> no, okay, okay. So uh, the premise of the game is we're trying to get the most loot then, right? That's it, exactly. Uh, so uh, we each have our own character, so mm -hmm. who do we have on the table today? In yes. fact, uh, pass your, your character cards in, because... Uh, there are some special abilities, and I'm sure we'll we'll learn how they work and just how nasty they can be during the game. Exactly. But let's introduce everybody first. So we'll yeah. start with John's character. I will probably screw up this name. This is Cheyenne. I like that. I think that's about oh, as close as I'll get. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so the special ability is this little symbol here. So exactly. what does this mean? So one of the things you're going to be doing in the game will be punching your other cowboy and bandit friends, trying to yeah. get loot off them. And Cheyenne, not only does it make the person you punch drop the loot, mm -hmm. she actually gets, if it's a coin purse, to grab it as well. Ah. So she can actually not only make you lose loot, but steal it at the same time. She's a bit of a pickpocket. Yeah, exactly. She's, yeah, a, exactly. she's a deft little bugger. You know? <laughs> 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 All right. So the next one is Django. Yeah. So, so what can Django do? I'm seeing a gun symbol. Here, this, yeah. this makes me nervous. He's got a big blast of a rifle. So, not only does he shoot you and add bullet cards to your deck, which is going to make your deck weaker, mm -hmm. but he also can knock you back, which ah. means he's going to be able to keep you away from wherever he wants to be. Ah, I see. And then the last character is mine. I have Ghost. Yeah. And Ghost has this little one and a tunnel symbol here. So, what's that going to do for exactly us? Exactly right. So, over the course of each round, you're going to play a certain number of cards, normally about four or five. And the tunnel cards means that you play your cards in secret face down. Mm -hmm. Ghost's ability lets him play the first card every round face down. Oh. Oh. Gives him that air of secrecy when he starts to kind of plan out his actions because this game really is all about planning out some actions and seeing them just unravel. Ah, I see. <laughs> all right, so uh, we each have a deck of cards here. So if, I'll quickly cycle through my one and then yeah. I'll shuffle it. Absolutely. Just, just to be fair. Yeah. So, uh, so this is the punch card. What's this going to do for us? So what the punch card does is it's going to... Take someone in your space, so someone in the same car, same space as you, it's going to knock them back into the adjacent car and it's going to force them to drop a piece of loot onto the ground. Okay, and then that's within the 3D train here. So can we yeah. be on the top and the bottom of this? Yeah, you must be in the same spot. So if you're inside, you have to punch somebody's inside as well. If they're on the roof, you can reach them. Yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, our next one is the shoot action. How's that going to work inside the, the train here? So essentially, if you're inside the train, shooting lets you shoot anybody who's adjacent to you in the next train over. Mm -hmm. If you're on the roof, you can actually shoot the full length of the train, just ah. so long as you can see them. And what that's going to do is it's going to let you put your bullet cards into your opponent's decks and start to make their decks a little bit more useless, because the bullet cards don't do anything. Mm -hmm. uh, we then have a couple of movement cards here. Yeah. So we have one for left to right. So what does that let me do inside and outside the train? Pretty straightforward. If you're inside the carriage, you can move one across, one mm -hmm. left or right. If you're outside, you can move up to three. In this case, because we're playing with three players, you can basically move the full length of the, mm -hmm. the locomotive and carriages. Okay, we then have one that's got an up and a down arrow on it. I'm assuming that's just move from the lower part of the train to the upper part exactly. of the train. Exactly. Or, or vice versa. It's, it's climb. So if you're outside, you'll go inside and vice versa. Mm -hmm. And the key thing to note is you must always follow the actions once they're in the deck. You can, so if, if, even if the so client would be, action you, have, here. you have yeah. no choice of to not yeah. do something. Exactly. Okay. Okay. okay, we then have uh, this one, which is the marshal. Yeah. The, the little yellow dude up the front here. So the marshal's guarding, just if you look very close, a little lockbox there worth $1,000. It's really the big prize on mm -hmm. the train. This is all passenger gems and cap money, but the lockbox is where the big dollar is. Mm -hmm. The problem with the marshal, though, is we can actually move him with cards and actually get him to move up and down the train. And if so, he moves into a space with another player... That's this card then? Yep. Okay. He's going to knock you out onto the roof mm -hmm. and essentially prevent you from getting anything from inside. Yes. He really can mess things up and will make things interesting. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then the last one, I'm guessing the dollar sign is just, I'm going to pick up something in the car. Exactly. If, you, if there's something in your space, exactly where you're standing, you can pick one of the items up. You've got the gems are worth 500, lockbox is 1,000, and the little coin purses, they range between about 250 and 400 dollars, and they do vary. So you're not sure exactly what you're getting when you've got this. Yeah. Okay. So six cards to the hand. That's it. So you have 10 to start. You're going to shuffle up and draw six. Okay, I'll draw my six. 
And so I'll be first player? Yep. All right, so I have to decide where I'm starting now. That's it. In either the caboose or the carriage next to the caboose. Mm. I will start in the caboose. So I'll go right to the back of the train because there's some nice gems sitting there worth 500 a pop. Nice. Which might be useful. So Shan? Mm-hmm. Uh, Shan's going to join Justin in. No? Nope. Yeah, you get to go in there one adjacent. That's, that's right, exactly. Yes, that's right. right. Which okay. leaves you as having to pick who do you want to stand next to? Who do you think? I'm going to hop you? into the one. With Josh? Ah, I'm going to look at this. Hey! All those gems are too tight. <laughs> I have tempting. a friend! <laughs> one thing I haven't mentioned, it's very important. At the end of the game, there's mm -hmm. a $1,000 bonus bounty oh. for the person that shoots the most bullets. Mm. So we all start with six in the chamber. Yep. Every time you successfully make a shot action, you're going to put, give one of those to one of your opponent players. Mm -hmm. Whoever has fired the most in the game gets a 1000 And if there is a tie, They'll both get the bonus. So okay. it can really be a game changer at the final count. Okay. Mm -hmm. So all we need to do now is flip over the first round. There's going to be five rounds. Mm -hmm. Let's oh, see so what that's we've got. This little deck here. Exactly. And uh, so this is telling us how many cards we're playing, whether they're face up or face down, yep. and if there's a special, it'll be here. Yeah. Exactly right. All right. So nice open stretch, couple of tunnels, and I will play my first face down because that's what my special ability lets me do. Sneaky ghost. Yep. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Okay. I like to sneak. I'm going to have a quick look at what I've got. So what is it? What so we're, you going, we're going clockwise, time. yeah. Okay, so my first action is going to be loot. Okay, so you're just Call grabbing, me not grabbing surprised. some money, of course. <laughs> Yourself. Um, mm. Oh, that poker face. He's, he's instantly getting yeah, into it. Yeah, I'm instantly thinking. So I'm going to climb for my first action. Oh, you're getting out of the way. Okay. Uh -huh. mm. Okay, so the next one has to be played face down That's by all it. of us. All of us. So this is basically the train going through a tunnel, everything going dark. And mm -hmm. everyone get a chance to do some stuff without actually knowing what's mm -hmm. been planned. Um, I don't like what's in my hand. Okay. Is there something I can do here? Yeah, exactly right. So if you don't want to play a card, instead of playing it, you can draw three more cards and pop them into your hand from your deck. Yeah, I want to do that because I think it'll be useful at this point. So one, two, three. Okay. Shane. Mm -hmm. Right. Face down. Face down. I'm going to play that. Okay. And as your one. Oh, so now I know that you've passed, which means you've only got one action ahead of me. Oh, that's tough. I think I'm going to do this. Secret okay. action. So it's back to me, and now it's back to being open with what yep, we're doing. Yeah, that's it. So I think... I am just going to loot from where I'm at and knock over Cactus. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yourself, John? Uh, I'm going to shoot. Okay. Oh my. Oh, dearie, dearie. Oh, it's got, it's got intriguing straight away. Uh, I... Well, this is the thing about this game. Whenever you can't see what's going on, you're kind of guessing what your opponent's doing, where they're going to be. What exactly. would I do in that situation? I'm going to move the marshal for my oh, third no. action. Okay. All right, so for the fourth one, this is now hidden, yeah? Mm-hmm. I will do this. So this is quite a long round. There's going to be a long action chain to follow this, everybody. Yeah, this is not going to go smooth. <laughs> no. John's one face down. I'm okay. Play that. <laughs> oh, that just sounds sinister. Yes. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna play this. All right, and the last one we play open. So my final thing, I'm gonna move because I think I want to have that ability just to maybe get away from someone okay. if it's all going horribly wrong <laughs> yeah. at the end. John, I'm going to shoot. Oh my! Oh my. God. He's really going for it. All right. <laughs> and yourself, as I'm gonna punch, just preparing in case any of those moves end up in someone in my space. Ah, okay. All right, so now this deck flips over. Exactly right. And now we're going to run through exactly in the order they were played. Mm -hmm. And you, whatever the action says, you must do. Mm -hmm. So the first thing I'm doing, I'm taking a shot. Oh, wow. So <laughs> I'm going to shoot you, John. Yeah. yeah. So, so you will get one of these into your deck. Yeah, because we're in the same carriage, yeah. Django isn't a valuable target for ghosts. Yeah, so it must go to the carriage over. Exactly. Yeah, which is absolutely fine with me. So now we're on to the, the actions that you guys yeah. did say you were playing. Now, here's the thing. This is a bit of a memory game as well. Yes. Now these are flipping. But it's the, the secret cards that you'll see revealed exactly under the camera right. now. So the first action that you chose to do was loot, John. Yep. So if you want to grab gem, something. got a gem, three I'll coin bags. Take a gem. Yeah. Colour right. me not surprised. I know. Yeah. Straight for the jewels every time. <laughs> yeah. Put this out of the way. Our next one is your climbing. I'm getting out of dodge. I didn't want to be between the gunsling and action that was going down there. I wanted to kind of maybe get a bit of fresh air. That's fair enough. So the next action is, John, you're actually moving the marshal. I am. Oh, wow. So so he may move one carriage in either direction. Because he can't go forward past the locomotive, of course, he's going to be able to move up. He cannot. The marshal stays inside, but if he moves into space with the bandit, he's going to make the bandit jump out. All right. Mm -hmm. 
So uh, as you're gonna move. Oh, he's going for it. Oh, he's going my. for the, the, the lockbox. Django does a big dashing, darting run straight to the locomotive. Ah, and then we're on to the revealed ones again. So I loot. So I will get to nab a gem. And come, yeah. here, come here, come here, come here. <laughs> so that's 500 in my bank, which is fine. Next up is, ooh, oh, ho, oh, 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 damn it. Glad I got out of there. Yeah, so <laughs> John is now shooting me. Yep. Can shoot, can shoot the marshal. Marshal's impervious to bandit bullets. It's not worth it. It's too but much. Can yeah. you shoot the deputy? Uh, <laughs> what you're doing him? <laughs> ow! Ow! <laughs> it was worth it. It was worth it just for the giggles. Oh, no. It was worth it. Yeah. Fair oh, enough. So next up, we have. As you are now moving the marshal, yeah. so actually you could move the marshal into John. I mean, it's going to be what's it's happening. Going to happen. I don't want yeah. him coming back to me. <laughs> So the marshal's going to hop in, which means he's going to give John a, a shot. Yep. Yep. So bullet goes into John's deck, and yep. it, John has to then jump, or Shane has to jump out of the train yep. to avoid any further discrepancies or any further damage. Yep. But that's fine, I got some loot out of it. Yep. <laughs> and then that leaves myself. I'm going to climb, okay. so I'm just going to go from here. Look. I don't want to move the board too much. Oh yeah. So I went outside of the tree and now we're all outside of the tree. And I, just, I just realized I've made a huge mistake in my card order. Oh yeah. no! <laughs> yeah, because the next one for John. He comes <gasps> back down. Is he gone? Boom. I take another shot. You go down, you swing out in a rope, in a window, realize the marshal's there. Yeah. Swing out the other side. Yeah, but as um, you've now shot yeah, as well. Yeah. And yeah is it the first person you come to or can you pick any of us? So whenever you're on the roof of the carriage, or on, on the tree in the locomotive, um, you shoot the first person in your line of sight, which means Cheyenne oh, is my only got another one. My only choice. Oh, oh that's, I've, that's made this, <laughs> I've made this. made this bad for myself. Django's ability is also that he knocks people back when he shoots them. Yeah. So, yeah, so you you're going to join back. Ghost, which might actually be good for you. It might actually see if you. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. Because I have my next action, which is to move. Oh, okay. So from where I am, uh, I am going to go <laughs> straight up the front. Following the cool kids. Uh -huh. Yeah, running away. And then the next one is for yourself. Oh, it's a shot. <gasps> <laughs> oh. Threw yourself into the line of sight? No, actually, <coughs> I wouldn't have been in line of sight because I was in the same carriage. I was forced to move, so it's yeah. actually good that I came up to you because mm -hmm. now we're both viable targets. So, yeah, John, Ghost or Django. I want to get one little coin first. Don't forget. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> Ghost gets it. All right. But the, the last one is last you card. were clever about. You punch me. I punch you. <laughs> <laughs> so you had a choice between definitely getting shot or definitely getting punched. It was kind of tough. So I'm going to ask you to drop your gem yep. right here on the top of the locomotive. So where it we falls both are. on the caboose. That's it. Or not the, on the, locomotive. the locomotive. Yeah, so it's there. Wow. Oh, what, what a round. round. Yeah. What a round. <laughs> that was awful for me. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I don't know. It's bad enough for everybody. I think everyone got, like, John got two shots off. I got a shot off. Ghost yeah. got a shot off. Like, but so the lots only of... one that ended up getting some loot out of that round was John. Yes, yeah. but I took four bullets for it. <laughs> but you did get two shots off, which means you currently you're in the lead for that thousand. But I took four. <laughs> <laughs> well, so the deck's nicely mu muddled up now. Yep. I assume I have to quickly sort That's this. That's it. Yeah? So you split those out into each character, and what's going to happen now is we're going to be given our original ten cards, plus all of those bullets that we've all received, maybe some more than most. <laughs> um, and they'll get shuffled in, which means when we draw our six cards for the next yep. round, you're going to have some blanks in there, yep. um, which is going to slow down your, your sort of ongoing play. Yeah. Yeah. Um, All right, and so we discard this. That's uh, it. Card Round that, one's out the way. Card that we were in. So now the second leg of our journey will get revealed, and we'll have a different set of circumstances to play with. Oh, this is going to be so bad. <laughs> <laughs> All right, one, two, three, four. Okay. What do I have here? Okay. All of a sudden, the serious poker faces come out. Yeah, they <laughs> yeah. really do. After the bullets have been flying for a round, we now get a bit more. Yeah, so I will play. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, I, I need to reveal. Yeah. I have to reveal and see if we get anything. Uh, so we'll, it will be John to go first this time now, because you were first player last round, so it'll come round to ah, John. But we have new symbols on here. Yeah, awesome. So this is going to be a four card round. Uh -huh. So we've got two face up, and then we've got a face down, and then a final face up. But we've also got the symbol that says we're going to be going counterclockwise. So we're going right. to go backwards. So it'll start with Cheyenne. And then work the way around this way. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so then this, this other little symbol. Yeah. So at the end of the round, the marshal is going to go on a bit of a rampage. Uh -huh. He is going to shoot anybody who's on the top of his carriage, and then mm -hmm. he's going to try and move towards the caboose. Ah. So you got to bear in mind, once you're done with your final card, the marshal's going to get tagged at the end. All right. So uh, Cheyenne's going to start. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
Um, it's worth noting here that in the rule book, I find it a little bit vague that the kind of reverse play card isn't really clear if it's just the final card you do it on or the full mm -hmm. round. So I like to do it for the full round because it yeah, just yeah. gives you a nice mix. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Right, so for yourself, John, do you want to start playing in here? We'll do this. We'll try and do this one quickly so we can get yep. on to the actual uh, first action. The action cycle. Climbing. Okay. Ooh. Climbing. Okay. So uh, first one for me is hidden. Yep. For ghost ability. Mm, okay. Mm, mine's not hidden. I'm going to go down. I'll mm -hmm. climb. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And my second one, which is still face up? Yeah, still face up. Mm -hmm. Give the marshal. Okay. Ooh. Second one face up for me. I will also move the marshal. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Well, that's bad. Um, Marshall's getting involved. Yes, well, this, he is. this is the thing. He's heard someone jumping into the, the locomotive there. Yeah. So, as going after that. Uh, that big money prize might end up hurting him. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, uh, I think I'm probably going to have to draw three. I don't need some more options here. <laughs> okay. So while you draw three, yeah. This is your third. Fa this is a face down card now. It mm -hmm. is. So we're playing that face down. Okay. 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 I'll play this face down. Um, I really didn't get the card I wanted to see, unfortunately. Um, so I'm going to play this face down. Mm -hmm. Final card, then face up. Yep, uh, I'm going to play a loot. Mm -hmm. I am going to play a punch, just in case. I feel like this round's going to go badly for me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to run might. away. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we've quickly done this. Flip it over. Wait, That's it. If I don't send them flying everywhere, be careful about playing yeah. this at home. And we'll see what's happening first. So for my first thing that I wanted to do, see well, we she she first. Yeah, she first. Yep, there you go. So John's getting to move. Going down into uh, the carriage. Yeah, climbing. Uh, then I'm going to loot, so I'll get my gem back. Yes, you will. <laughs> which uh, I think is important for me. Because I, I don't want to just leave it rattling on top of the, no. the, the engine yeah. there. No. So now we're on to some of the hidden ones. All right? And uh, this grimace. is, this is going to suck. So you climb. Yeah, which means I have to go down into the locomotive. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I'll put that out of the way. The next one that's going to happen is the marshal's going to move with John. I want you to consider, just before you instinctively move the marshal, consider moving him into your own space. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> so the marshal will move. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, no. And I move the marshal. Oh, no. <laughs> so the marshal is going to move up in there, so if you do that for me there, Ah, So that means Django's going to have to run away, um, and he's going to take a bullet he's gonna for take a his... Bullet and get to the roof. Trouble, yeah. For his trouble. Trying That's to get. get for being greedy. Oh, I wondered that was so close to the lockbox. Mm -hmm. And then, John, you get to loot again. Yep. Yeah. So grab what you want. So we didn't have a card for me there because I decided to draw three, which is why we didn't get one. Yeah. So that's another gem for me. Yeah. Then I'm going to move. Oh, okay. And I'm going to move. Oh, uh, sorry. Bring up on camera would help. I'm going to move to here. Interesting. Just to be a little bit out of the way because okay. I know that Marshall is moving across by one. Mm hmm. You'll be shooting above him and then moving across by one. Yeah, exactly. Right. And then we're on to the final. So, ah. Oh, hello. 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 <laughs> hello. You shoot me. <laughs> yes, I will. So I think I shot at Ghost. Give me a bullet. Which is going to knock you back. <sighs> now, if I was right on the back of the carriage, do I go any further? No, you would just stop there. Luckily, you'd be able to grasp on and hold on to the roof. Okay. And then the last cycle of cards we do is. John's going to loot again. Another gem, oh, Shane? Can I interest you in <laughs> Yes, you can. <laughs> wow. Uh, Next up is I'm going to punch thin air, <laughs> and then you're going to move. Yeah, this was a tough decision. I really wanted to um, to try and get back into a carriage somewhere, but there was just no safe places at all. So mm. I think I'm just going to move one to here. All right. uh, Special action then at the end of the round. Marshall. So Marshall brap, brap, brap. shoots the top, but no one's there, and then he will move one across beneath Django. Yeah, which surprises me because now you can't move back down in there. Well, yeah, it's tricky because um, I really want to get that lockbox. I kind of feel like it's a moral victory at this point. <laughs> um, so, quick note just for the people at home. So, I've only got one coin purse. Cheyenne has a coin purse and three gems. And Ghost, you have a gem and a coin purse. Yeah. But it's all hidden from each other, so really we don't know at this stage. Don't know the final yeah. values. There's really no point kind of worrying about it too much until we do the final count. Although, I do like the fact that you're shuffling your deck every round. Yeah, absolutely. Keeps it fresh. Look at you guys with your super shuffles. Oh, uh, you see, you've actually got three variants of the of shuffling here. So you've got you doing traditional. You've got John doing a uh, proper, you know, like magic player, and you've got me doing a, a triple shuffle. <laughs> so 
So let's get rid of that round card and we're going to go into round three of five. Yeah, so let's see what we're getting this time. Ooh. Wow. So this is this important. This is important. Couple of things new here. So we've got a face up card, uh -huh. then a face down card, yep. then a double face up, which means you get to play actions back to back. So you get two actions, so yeah. I could draw and then play one? Absolutely, or just okay. play and play, so you get them back to back. Mm -hmm. Final face up, and then at the end, there's going to be another lockbox introduced to locomotive. Got it. Um, so we'll get another thousand pounds bounty added in. Uh, well, dollars. Dollars. Oh, <laughs> dollars. Keep forgetting the Wild West is not in <laughs> Ireland. <laughs> right, so we're starting with yeah, this time. Yeah, so Django to go first. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah, do you know what? I think just... And now it's back to clockwise, yeah? Yeah, back to normal clockwise. There's no, no reverse symbol mm -hmm. on this one. All right, let's 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 get them in quick. So I'm going to move the marshal. Mm -hmm. uh, mm. Ghost gets his usual. I'll play my time. secret. Okay. Okay. Um... <sighs> I'm going to draw three. Oh, I think I should have done that. I'm going to draw three now for my second. And I will play a secret. So I will do that. Okay. And then we're on to the... the uh, not just yet, because um, I went first, so John's got his. Is that right? Oh, yeah, John still has his for the, the hidden. Yeah. Oh, yeah, for the I for the face yeah. line card, yeah. Um, let's have a looky look. <laughs> I'm going to play that face time. Okay. Okay, so now we've got the double actions. Mm-hmm. So I will ah, double. Ah, wait for oh, me. Yeah, yeah, sorry. I, I get <laughs> so all excited. I, I have a plan. I have a clean plan, but will it work? Um, so I'm going to move. All right. And then climb. Okay. Do you wonder what you're doing? Um, <laughs> I will have a climb and a loot. Okay. Cheyenne. Okay. I am going to. Your hand. <laughs> oh dear, evilness, evilness. I sense <laughs> evilness. <laughs> Come and get me. Come and get Skull me. Skullduggery. Double shoot. <gasps> oh. oh my. If he catches someone, that's going to hurt. Oh my. Uh, so, final round single card then. Yeah. I'm really hoping that I can just get a nice little loot. Uh, I'm hoping to get a shot off. <gasps> my word. <laughs> um, I'm right. playing with a bunch of villains. One last final card. I'm going to climb. Okay, trying to get out of the way. <laughs> All right, so wow. flip it. Yep. And let's see what we start getting. So, so it starts with Django. Yeah, so Django for the first is going to move the marshal. Where are you going to move him? Da, da, da. Color me not surprised. Get mm -hmm. him out of the way. That's fine. Uh, for myself, I'm going to move. Okay. So if I could put stuff in the right way around, it would help. <laughs> so, so where are you going? going to move right the way up the front. Oh, I didn't think it was going to be that risky. Mm. Yeah. Uh, then you guys didn't play, so yeah. I actually also get to move the marshal. Mm -hmm. Which means, into John. Oh my goodness. So John gets kicked out. Mm -hmm. And take a bullet. Yeah. Swines. All on the roof again. Yep. <laughs> then John gets to move the marshal. <laughs> so. And move it back. He's just one. patrolling the whole train at he's this stage. He's just walking, like, and he's like, I don't see anybody here. I swear, <laughs> he's like one of the, you know, remember the AI in some of the, the old games for the bots, which is like, I heard something. What was that? There's nothing here. Probably nothing. Like Metal Gear Solid <laughs> ones. Yeah. 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 What was that right. noise? Now we're on to some of the exposed actions. So for you, it's a move. So this is interesting because the game board has changed to where it was initially. Yeah. Um, my original plan might not be as good as it was anymore, knowing that you've got a double, double shoot. shoot coming. Yeah. Um, but I think I think I will move to here. OK. Yeah. This is risky. Yeah, it is. All right, so the next card up. Yeah. As you're climbing. Yeah. <laughs> no. Let's see what Goose does. He will climb. Oh, he's getting out of dodge. He will loot. No way. Oh. <laughs> so pay me my money. Yes. The loot box is collected. Oh, oh. I wasted a double shoot. Oh yeah. <laughs> we both got out the way. Oh, man. Because here's John. Shoot. Shoot Lovely. at the air. Yep. Oh. In frustration. <laughs> I see them. Up, up, up. Where'd it go? <laughs> to be fair, it's only a pistol shot. Yeah. So next up is you trying to loot. There's nothing there. Beaten to it. There's me trying to shoot, but you're too close. Yeah. <laughs> and then there's John climbing down. Yeah. Well, at least it's not into the marshal. Yeah, yeah. that could have went worse. 
Could have nice little blessings. <laughs> At the end of this round, then, uh -huh. we're going to get another loot box dropped ah, in yeah. um, to ah. the locomotive. Up here? Yep. All right. And <laughs> I think I go first this round. You do indeed. Oh, dear. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so let me quickly cycle these out again so yep. that everybody's got what they're, they're meant to have. So I'm feeling Justin may be winning this one. It's okay. Django, Django's on his tail. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm expecting to get maybe punched a few times here. Django, gonna punch ghost. It was such a good movie though. <laughs> okay. Being as quick as we can. Oh. Yeah, so it's, like, it's interesting that we're, this is three rounds in now, but going to the fourth round, yeah. this carriage, completely untouched. <laughs> yeah, where, where all the shiny stuff is. This is like first class. It's like the Bandit Protection Society. To be fair, there was like two or three gems in the caboose, which yeah. I have. Yeah, so John's got about 1,500, maybe 1,750 there if I work it out right. Yeah, something like that. So we need the next round card for the fourth yeah. round. So I'll pop this one out of the way. And we get our fourth round. So this is the penultimate round. Ooh. Wow. Okay. Else so four actions. So we've got a face up, face down, then two face up. Yeah. The final little symbol in this one is at the end of the round, essentially uh -huh. a big, if you imagine the old kind of fashioned Wild West yeah. swing arms is going to come along and the train's going to essentially come under that. So anybody who's on the roof is going to get pushed to the back carriage as they basically dodge and swing onto the arm. Mm -hmm. Could right, so be very relevant for looking or for loot box control. Yeah. So who's going first this round? So with one, two, three, so fourth round it's over it's to me. Ghost. Hmm. Alright, I will play my first one hidden, yeah? Yeah. Ghost's ability kicking in again. Alright, so I'll play that one then. Okay. It's over to me. Yeah. Gonna draw three. Oh, I did not draw a punch. <laughs> really? I did not draw oh. a punch. Ah! <laughs> Don't tell me that though. Oh, this, Although I this, suppose this is all just a ploy, but I have to play mine face up, unfortunately. Which so means... you're going to move, yeah. Yep. So it's back to me. And they're face down normally, no? Now it's face down for everybody, yep. For a second card. I'll play one face down. Mm -hmm. I'll play that face down. Okay. Uh, I'll play this face down. Uh, now it's face up. Now it's face up for the third card. Uh, right, I am going to risk a shot at this stage. Okay. Uh, a lot of shenanigans going on, but I don't think I'm going to be available to shoot anything. <laughs> mm. So I'm going to play a move. Okay. Uh, then as? I am going to climb. Okay. I'm going to punch. Okay. So that was your final one? Yep. Yeah. So John, Shane. I'm gonna play a loot. Okay. Um as. I'm gonna play a shoot. Okay. <laughs> You're really unsure about that, weren't you? I don't think it's gonna to come to anything, but we'll see. You never right. you just never know. No, that's true. So uh unfortunately the first hidden card I played was oh. a loot. Mm. So <sighs> I get that wow, second lock box. Oh my goodness. Which is lovely. And I have two grand. Oh my word. And then we're on to your guys' actions. Yeah. So uh, let's see what so we So you're moving. Oh, you drew for, yeah, of course. Yep. So it came so to my move. Uh, so I'm going to head into first class. Yeah. Uh, I am going to climb up and out of the way. Okay. I've accidentally stolen one of your gems with my, <laughs> with my arm. Sorry about <laughs> that. Uh, That's fine. You're going to hit me now, though. John's going to move the marshal. Oh! No, Joss. Oh, can I take someone bullet? coming into first class? Get no. him. You hey. must protect the first class passengers. There's your billet. Oh, my goodness. Uh, help me, help you. Um, um, <laughs> unfortunately, you are helping me. Your loot is now worthless. Not worthless. I just get nothing. Loot in the air. I then go for a shoot. Oh, dear. Oh, God. <laughs> there you go. Thanks. Oh, that, was... oh, that went badly. I had a feeling someone might come up to try and hit me there. Yeah. Yeah, so you prepared for it. Yeah. yeah. You didn't expect me to shift him up there for no. you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, then the next oh, one. Brutal. Is John's going to move, which makes sense because there's no more loot in that particular yeah. car. Then we have. I've cleared the caboose. You're going to climb down. <laughs> oh, no. And take another round to the base. <laughs> oh, back in the first class, back out of first class again. Is he gone? No. No, he's still there. Uh, then for the last three is I'm going to punch thin air because I thought if you move towards me, yep. I can at least knock something out of your hand. 
Then it's a loot for John. Ooh, yep. one well three played. Three, yeah. I'll just take one in the middle. And then the last one for yourself as is a shoot. Yeah. So you actually do get to hit me. A little bit of vengeance. <laughs> Whew. Cold that, iron. That yeah. was a rough ride. Mm -hmm. It was. I must admit, that did not go how I planned in my head. <laughs> <laughs> that one, the single impact of a single martial card can change the entire Turn. way it plans yeah, out. Yeah, you're forced yeah. completely out of where you meant oh, to be. Oh, my word. Okay. So right. this is going to be going into the final round. We'll get the cards back and shuffle up. So I've got one coin purse for anyone keeping track of them. <laughs> Cheyenne has three gems. And two bags. Two bags. Uh, and has fired twice, but you've fired three times. I have. Yep. Ghost has two loot boxes, a gem, and a bag. Okay, if I can take home the Gunslinger Award, I'll be happy with that. I think that's at least pride. It's a Pyrrhic victory, yeah. Yeah. Uh, is it Pyrrhic or Ferric? Oh, what would I do? Pyrrhic. Okay. I think it's Pyrrhic. Alright. I don't know. Someone will tell us. Yeah, someone yeah. will. How to English? Now, what you don't want to do is over the course of four rounds get shot lots of times so when you draw your final hand of the game you draw a lot of bullets that's what you don't want to do all right <laughs> <laughs> so for our final round this is what our setup is okay and so what's this symbol mean yeah then? so we're used to all the other ones the last symbol essentially at the end of this round any bandits in a carriage where or on the roof if there's a coin purse sitting by you you can lift it okay only a coin purse no, no gems or, or loot boxes but still opportunity to get a last bit of swag as we arrive at the station yeah Okay. Okay, so Cheyenne, to start off. Mm -hmm. Face up. Face up. I'm playing a loot. Alright, I'm gonna play my, ah, my usual face down. Oh yeah, yeah, sorry, it's been this guy. This guy, I know. I get excited. I get excited. Well it's okay, oh. I'm just drawn three because I might have drawn a few bullets. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll play my usual face down. <laughs> yep. Okay. Uh back to me. Uh yep. Face up All again. Right. Uh I'm gonna climb. Okay, so this is also a face up, yeah? This is also face up, yeah. Um, All right. um, oh my home. goodness. Uh, he needs to play some. Oh, if I could show the people at home the quandaries. The quandaries. Um, <laughs> I, uh, I'm going <laughs> to climb. Okay. <laughs> uh, I'm going to draw three. Okay. Because I oh. don't have what I want. Okay. Two, three. Well, while you've done that. Uh -huh. uh, this is my. This is the third card. So this yeah, is face, face down. down. Now. Play that face down. Um, I will play this face down. I'll play this face down. And final face up card. Final face up card. Well, it's, it's a no choice for me to be honest. I'm going to climb. Okay. Uh, I'm going to loot. I'm going to move. I want the survey to show the records to state for future sake. If you don't move the marshal, Aye. I'm in a lot of trouble. <laughs> I've banked on you moving the marshal. As, as, as. Yeah, I'm yourself. <laughs> My first action. Move the marshal. Oh, Shane. Oh, no. He gets the loot. Oh, my goodness. So you do get the loot, John. You forgot <gasps> when the activations were happening, and I was like, oh, oh this is. Ah, but I move the marshal. Yeah, that's fine. Can I recommend the locomotive? <laughs> no, I, I was going to move it into John. Yeah, I think that sounds like so. John's going to take a neutral bullet card. Not that it yep. really matters at this stage, but it can actually affect tiebreakers. So mm, we we'll still deal them out. I think uh, I've taken the most bullets, to be honest. Then you climb, John. Oh dear. Oh dear. I've taken an uh, Down and up. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> is he gone? No. Big no, mistake. Still there. All right. The next one is you yeah, climbing. That's is fantastic news. So there you go, guys. Uh, John's going to shoot me. Yep. Ah. Awesome. Hunt. Oh my! Three bullets shot each. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you're gonna loot as? <gasps> yes, I am. <laughs> my second piece of loot. <laughs> I'm going to climb for mine. So put me down. Into the locomotive. Then we're on to some of these hidden ones again. So for John, it's <gasps> oh my oh. god. <laughs> so were you just going? I'm gonna climb for the last bit. I don't here. get it. I could have sworn I put in something that actually let me move somewhere. <laughs> oh my <laughs> goodness. Other than into yeah. him. But last one for you is you'll also loot. I'll take this wee bad boy. <laughs> and I will move in there. For nothing. Ah, but the end of round action is going to be anyone who's got a coin purse on the floor, they can nab it up. So you were first to go. Yeah. Yep. So come to myself. So I'm, I'm going to take this one. And then uh, Ghost. I will grab this one. Wow. I'm quite happy with that final round. That went okay for me. <laughs> that, that pretty much went exactly as I want it. Yeah. 
the, that sheriff marshal move that was just if it hadn't happened that whole round would have been completely different for John and I I think mm-hmm. that would have just been chalk and cheese yeah but it's, it's it's that thing I just I wanted to make sure I had like two shoots in my hand there and it was just like do I shoot nah yeah. let, let's go for glory yeah if one of us had kind of fired an extra shot or two you would have kind of not really had a yeah. chance now, here's the thing you guys are both tied for the number of shots yeah yep. so we're both going to get the thousand pound bounty bonus dollar Dollar. Oh my goodness! Every <laughs> time. All right, so let's flip over the the tokens and figure out what we all got. Okay. Do you want to do you want to do it in the camera? Uh, no, it's okay. Uh, we'll just we'll do the math. Oh wow! So I am on three thousand two hundred and fifty dollars. Oh, you've probably. Yeah, I think. Um, I think that's. I think that's going to do decisive. It. I have two thousand. That's not bad. John. <sighs> so you have two thousand. No, I'm John, actually, I get it. I'm actually. Close, close. So three five hundreds. Yep. So fifteen hundred plus a thousand for the shooting. Four hundred, three hundred, two fifty. Uh, My math is terrible, by the way. Uh, so, so hang on, let me see so, again. So that's nineteen hundred. That's twenty two hundred. That's twenty four fifty. And you're on. Oh no, sorry. Forget no, sorry. That's two. Th- sorry, two thousand. Two thousand five hundred. Two thousand nine hundred. Three thousand two hundred. Three thousand four hundred fifty. Yeah. I'm on. Thirty-two fifty. Oh, <gasps> Shay, and with this deal, despite the last action, well played, nicely done. <laughs> I don't even deserve a handshake. I don't feel uh, you'll get it anyway. <laughs> it's fine. But that was a lot of fun. I yeah. really didn't think John was going to get it. That double shot just dragged you into the yeah. point where you could get that extra one k. That last, that firing that last bullet, that round, yeah. um, and making sure you had a target for it before Ghost got out the way. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah, well, guys, uh, that has been Colt Express. It's yeah. a lot of fun. I love the fact that it's got the 3D elements. Yep. Uh, we will head on here. Get your comments down below. Did you enjoy it yourselves? Is it one you want to play? We'll move on. We'll see you in the next one. We hope you enjoyed this Let's Play. Go ahead and check out our other content on screen now. And be sure to check out beastofwar.com for the latest gaming news and gaming Let's Plays. And while you're at it, why not hit subscribe and remember to ding our dong. Go on, you know you want to click it. Go on.